This is a small uh, quick video for our juniors to be confident during diagnosis of scrotal varicocele. Here I'm putting my probe transversely at the region of the of the scrotal left scrotal neck. I'm going downwards, downwards. This is the region of the bambiniform plexus. Downwards, the bambiniform plexus here are dilated. I'm going downwards. All are dilated. Yes, are, are dilated. Now I am just near that uh, bididymis, and this is the left testicle. My issue here is to give you the confirmation and the confidence how to diagnose how to diagnose the uh, reflux in the varicocele. First of all, I know almost all of us we will measure the a the we will measure the 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 widest diameter of the vessels passing at that region. And we can measure this diameter in transverse view, which is a better than in longitudinal. Okay, like that, we can measure this or this. Uh, by guessing, you can see that this is the wider one or the wider one to have an idea about the diameter. Some doctors re relay upon degree of diameter in the grading of that varicose. Here, if we fix this, and you can come measure this diameter. It is about uh, two eight, uh, how, about eight. two uh, zero point two eight millimeter. That means it is two millimeter and a and eight. Ah, uh, it is two point eight. Two point eight millimeter. Okay, yes. two point eight millimeter. Now this diameter is considered wide. That means we can diagnose that this is at least a grade two. Very cozy. We can say that from B mode, grade two, or coming to be grade three. Our issue here is to diagnose: is it refluxing or not? How to be sure from this reflux? We will apply check first B mode. Now we bring some of the veins in our field of view. Then I'm trying to to fix my eye and my region of interest in some of these veins. Okay, and I should concentrate in one of the veins. I will adjust my hand again to be sure from some vein like that, like this. Sound please, yeah, Shabab. Okay, here I will ad uh, check that veins. If you find the veins that uh, they are wide like that, ask the patient to do something before doing any strain check this vein this vein looks huh red or or blue i cannot pick i will ask the patient to to do any straining you can do strain please and that is good color yes look i'm concentrating on that vein strain 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 ah you see it becomes red and the blue release here, there is some issues that make you unconfident. Is it refluxing or not? Okay, forget what you did and go to another area to have a confident decision. Another area means another, another vein, like that. This vein is blue. Ask the patient to deep breathe, please. Yes, now the vein appears very well, very, very, very straining. Release, 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 خلاص. it becomes red. The same vein. Our issue here is the same vein. The same vein becomes sometimes, sometimes uh, uh, red and sometimes blue. I am concentrating on this. You can ask me. If freeze and go back, maybe. Okay, I will freeze now. Now, go back. Huh? And this is very good, dear Shabab, to know, to, to make a scene video because using the cine video will help you to take a, de a confident decision like what here look to the same vein here huh? i will make cine go back now at this moment the vein was blue okay again i will concentrate on the same vein going toward the, the time of straining i will just ask the patient now straining strain 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 this is a cine huh not Real life. Ah, 
Now, during the strain, the, beige, the, the vein was a, was blue. I am concentrating my eye on this only vein. Okay? Huh? Huh. I asked the patient to release. Huh? This is the red color. You see? The same vein came blue, the same vein came red. Now, forget that vein and make your interest on this vein. Okay? I will review again. Huh? Look, ah, it was red, this one, this one, okay? Again, it becomes the same vein, becomes A, becomes a blue. Okay, forget those again and concentrate on the, that beside them, okay? Here, ah, the same vein becomes, is blue, it becomes A, becomes red. And this what means our... Our decision, it is significantly refluxing varicocele. One more issue here, if you have a patient like that, you can put the spectral study to be sure and sure and sure, to have a documentation. Uh, on this, at this moment, I will ask the patient to, you should use the, at this moment, you should use the triplex. This should be moving and this should be moving. Never to make this is fixed. You should see where is your area of interest. You should see where is A, where is your spectral uh, pattern or sample volume. I will concentrate on this vein. I will ask him to make what? Please strain. You see, you see, you see, see? Release, release, release. You see, uh, this is by what? By spectrum, there is above the baseline, and below the baseline, where in the same point. Take care, take care, take care. Because during the strain, these veins in the scrotum will move. But I'm taking it carefully without doing it to move. So that, without pressure also. So that I get it like this, I get it like this. Look, if we make a review the semi in color, huh, you see the color now, red. Okay, it is red, okay, and it becomes blue. This is confidently, significantly refluxing varicocele, and at this type of varicocele, you are not obligated to make the patient to stand. Okay, we are examining the patient while he is recumbent. Okay, mm -hmm. and if it is not refluxing by this diameter, I will ask the patient to stand, then I will check it while he is standing. I hope I make it a symbol for you. Thank you.